Hey guys. Um, so let's see here. We're um, going to do an unboxing video of We Are Not Your Kind by Slipknot. And uh, this is one of the, I don't know if you remember when I first started this channel, I absolutely love this group. And um, I kind of, I checked them out because they were from the same state I was born in, which is Iowa. They were not from the same city. I was born in Davenport. They're from Des Moines. But um, this is a group I really, really loved when I was a teenager and young adult. 18, somewhere around there, you know, I'm 24 now. But um, don't listen to them quite as much anymore. But I still do. They're one of the childhood bands I still enjoy. And uh, the main reason I bought this is because Joey Jordanson died. And I know that Joey Jordanson is not on this. I know that. But um, but this is my favorite release they did. I think they did a really good job on this album. I think this might be one of the best like alternative metals of metal albums of the 2010s, I think. Like, probably one of the best metal albums of the 2010s, I think. My opinion. Definitely one of the best in all metal of the 2010s. And uh, they're self-titled, so that's really, really great to get into. That's probably my second favorite they did. I think I just like this one a little bit more. And um, But that, uh, unfortunately, I was thinking of getting that one too, but that one is a uh, final of it's very, very expensive, so I was not able to get it. But And also, I um, wanted to get the CD of this too, because um, I basically own all their albums on CD, except for Make Big Kill Repeat and this one. But it's the only album I own by them on vinyl, though. Before we get into that, let's get into this. This is Thy Catafalque, a Hungarian, like, progressive metal band from, you know, Hungary, obviously. It's a little digi book. The main reason I got it. I don't think it's as good as Regatag, but it's still pretty good. I'd say it's one of probably my third or fourth favorite release they did. If I had to say. I think they did a good job. They're known for mixing like black metal, progressive metal, industrial metal, electronic music, and stuff like that with their music. This kind of has a bit of a synth wave sound at times. To me, it is. That's, uh, no, you know, the main number. Let's see here. That's it. Now, on to the Slipknot album. Wait, beat, kill, repeat. No, I'm sorry, we are not your kind, I'm sorry. All right, but anyways, rest in peace, Joey Jordanson. You are, were, are one of the greatest drummers in new metal, and the rest easy. You are... Probably the most talented member of the group, I would probably say, in my opinion. This is the inside of it. it has all the lyrics. Spine of it. The heck of the cover shot too. It might be my favorite out of their album covers as well. It's actually a really cool looking cover. This is pretty cool. So this is a little sheet of all the members of the group. Yeah, let's see. I think I remember all their names, and I usually, it's hard for me to remember names of band members, even my favorite ones, but for some reason I still know all of them. Um, that's Mick Thompson, he must be a new guy. It's Jim Root. Sid Wilson, he was my favorite member as a, as a kid. Corey Taylor. Sean Trahan. That's the Tortilla guy, the Tortilla Man, or whatever they call him, he's, he's a new member. Uh, Craig Jones, and that must be another new guy. The guy who replaced Chris, who replaced Chris, you know. All right, but um, so that and then on the back is this creepy looking goat thing, and uh, let's see. it's the first record. It's just the record's just black, so. Don't really need 
take it out, but no labels on it. Oh, and also here's the download code. If you guys want to download it. about it this album is um i'd say one of the more gothic sounding more experimental than their other releases i'd probably say and it's very heavily industrial influence i think at least um their most experimental release by far is still made for killer bees without a doubt but out of their post stuff this is probably one of their more art based releases i'd probably say has a lot of industrial influences. There's even some electronic kind of influence tracks on this. And I think Solway Firth is their best song. But anyways, um, You're Not Your Kind, great album of modern metal. My favorite Silk Mount album. And uh, you guys enjoyed watching this video. Bye.